Hawthorne Avenue in Cleveland, Ohio. I'm cleaning uh, two white bass. Uh, they're good sized white bass and one large mouth bass. Caught in Port Clinton by Trey and Gray. Okay? We're pretty frequent here. These are avid fishermen. Uh, they don't play around. Okay? I've just severed the head off of this uh, large mouth. And now we're going to fillet them out and I'm going to remove the skin on the fillet. Okay? Sharp knife. We're going to hit that backbone. Starting up at the shoulder of the fish. Okay. And we'll come down again. And we're going to work that rib cage. And then we're going to hit the other side of that backbone. And I'm going to sever that fillet from the other. Okay. All right. There's your fillet. Okay. Nice. On the other side, flip it over. Instead of coming from the shoulder, we're going to come on top of the dorsal fan and come up towards the shoulder. Knife got to be sharp. Dull knife will work the hell out of you. Definitely will. Okay. All right. Backbone, rib cage. Backbone, rib cage, whether it's a walleye or white bass or whatever, bluegill, it's always in the same place. Only time you might have difficulty is if that fish was injured in the growing up and it lived and you got a curved spine and humps in the back and all that kind of stuff okay there's your backbone okay cat wouldn't want it okay there's a white bass angle your knife get as much meat off of that head as you can lift it over right behind the fence okay all right, and we pop the neck. Start the shoulder on the left side of the fish. Come all the way down to the tail. And we go back up. Hit that rib cage. Let's hit it with that knife and go down. It's like going down a sliding board. And then get the other side of that back off. All right, we'll sever that for later. Okay. okay, now we're going to flip that over. I'm going to tone my edge up a little bit. Got a little bit of drag on it. Oh, that feels better. There we go. You know the anatomy of the fish, backbone, rib cage, and the knife is sharp. Just follow it all the way down. Okay? You have a minimal amount of waste. All right. This is a nice catch. Thank you, thank you. This one here. If you want to, you can like sever the head, but if you want to, you can leave the head on and work work with it from the head. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Same thing here. Hit, hit it on the top of the dorsal fan and come up towards the shoulder. Rib cage, backbone. All right. There's our backbone in the heads. Try to keep your board clean. Don't need anything that's on the inside, touch the net that's on the outside. These fillets are going to be boneless, with the exception of the pin bone, which can be removed if they want it. And we're going to skin them. I use some pit, pit, fisherman pincers to grab hold of the tail. And 
a sharp, narrow knife. There's your blade, skinless. There's the skin. Got a large mouth here. Bone on a large mouth, the pin bone is a little bit more significant than stand up. Kind of similar to that in the walleye. 